Gregory from Rodius. He's a uh, sales director of Europe and uh, Rodius is uh, one of the oldest partners with Tuna. So uh, we have a long history of cooperating together with customer and with supplier with this one. So I'm sure he has a lot of interesting stories and experience to share. Uh, my name is Alfred Berglund. I work at Tune as a product sales manager. Um, and I will be the host for this final session. And the main presentation will be done by Terry. Uh, he will go through what uh, Rodius does, what they do, how they do it, and uh, also how the solutions are uh, being presented, how the solutions work that they do for their customers. Uh, this is your contacts for depending on what type of region you are located in. So we have, for example, Rafi in uh, Denmark. Uh, and if you're located in either Sweden or Norway, you have me, Alfred. Uh, the Baltic States, oops, the Baltic States, um, we have Andris. And uh, if you're located in Poland, we have Robert. The main presentation together with uh, Terry. So I will hand over the, the podium to Terry and he will take us away. So it's my turn. Okay. <laughs> so welcome, welcome to you, and uh, thanks to be present for this uh, introduction, this presentation about uh, Rodios, how knowledge, how products, and how service also. So to start. Uh, first introduction, uh, a quick introduction of myself. So I am the head of sales for Europe at Rodius. I'm working for Rodius since 12 years with a first background in the technical department because in fact in the way of the, the sales, first of all, I was a R&D manager. So sometimes you can also see me like that wearing some uh, working clothes and directly on the seat and we will see later uh, it's a, it's a it's a part of our service and our knowledge so so first of all uh at Rodeos, our core of business is the knitted wire mesh when i talk about knitted wire mesh i talk about this technology exactly the same than for our socks or different pullover or something like that for sure, we are using different other wires, different uh, material than the wool, and we are using some, I stopped the sound, some machinery, of course, and not two needles like in the past. So we talk about the past. Uh, Rodius is, is an old company born in 25. So from 25 to today, from the metallic sponge, the first products from Rodius uh, based on the knitted wire mesh, in fact, uh, originally created and now for different technical and modern products like this ones for the automotive sectors. So a part of our calendar, the most important dates are 25 we born. Uh, in the, the years 70s was the first droplet separator, so the filter we will see later. In 2003, uh, the best cost location in uh, Hungary, what I call a best cost location, it's not a low cost location. I will have the time to, to talk about the difference for us later. 2011, uh, the best cost location in China, close to Shanghai for the Asiatic market. 2017, the Canadian location. And uh, one year later, uh, a location in the Middle East, it's only an agency. So we talk about our global presence, our global activity, for sure. So with different location in Bavaria, the headquarter of Produce at Weissenburg, close to Nuremberg, uh, Tapolka, Hungary, the, the location here, uh, Lag, sorry, and the location in Hungary, the Chinese location close to Shanghai, Canadian one, and the office in the Emirates to be present in GCC. So 
Today we are talking about how uh, presence in the Scandinavian areas with in particular our partner, uh, main partner TURN, uh, which is working in the Scandinavian area, like Alfred said, for sure, different uh, with a uh, different sharing and Andres, and also the Polish market uh, now with Robert. So for us, the main partner in these countries is TURN with the uh, different people. So an overview about our business evolution, about uh, the size of our company uh, com with the numbers. So you can see that we have uh, uh, evolutive numbers. So we are increasing for sure, perhaps, and for sure, in fact, for 2020, uh, numbers will be uh, amended because of the famous corona situation all over the world. But in fact, these pictures show to you that we are in a constant evolution and in constant progression on the business. So regarding the quality, uh, how certification is a minimum uh, necessary to be present uh, seriously face to the customers. And a few minutes ago, I talked to you about how uh, best cost location for us, you are here to certify, oh, sorry, you have the certificates from the Chinese company, the Chinese location. In fact, for us, the way is to propose the same products, the same level of quality of the products all over the world in the, our different locations. This is a difference we can explain uh, between a low cost and a best cost location. So for us, we talk about best cost location. So focus on the products. We are working with different raw materials. If I talk about the filtration, our main subject today, uh, we cannot use the same raw material to filter an oil, to filter a seawater, or to filter some acids, chloride, and so. So we are using daily different uh, metallic alloys like the stainless, the different nuances of stainless, galvanized, different specific alloys like uh, the alloy 20, for example, the titanium, the duplex, anyway. We are using also in parallel different plastic polymers wires. I talk about uh, polypropylene, PVDF, PTFA. We use also some composite fibers, mainly uh, for the moment for the, for the filtration, I think the glass fibers, but also the PTFA fibers. And we are able to work differently with this different material, but also to, to do some combination about these products. I mean, some products combination with a stainless and a glass fibers for the oil mill separation, for example. Uh, I talk us also about the uh, combination with uh, an alloy 20 and PTFA fibers for the acid sulfuric filtrations. So different combinations are possible, depends on the specification. We have also uh, different uh, original wires, I mean uh, the coated wires. In fact, in this case, for example, for the first one, it's a stainless wire coated with a PFA. In fact, the goal is to propose something with the mechanical resistance of a stainless, but also the chemical resistance of the PFA or PFA, it's a similar than the PTFA. So at the end, we are able to propose some filters, some demisters made with uh, this kind of wire, strong enough mechanically uh, for, for the mechanical uh, subject and strong enough for the chemical resistance. So different wires. Rodius, Rodius GmbH is sharing in two parts, the automotive and the rest. The filtration is in the rest. So, but quickly, an overview about our activity in the automotive sectors. So we are working in the arch environment, like I wrote. In fact, uh, in case of uh, extreme temperature, corrosive, aggressive products, electromagnetics, or mechanical thermal shocks, very high pressure. In fact, in lots of cases, we are present for the automotive. For example, solution for the static or dynamic ceilings, in the exhaust pipe, for example, shock, vibration, noise, attenuation, the thermal shielding, the EMC shielding for the electronic, the filtration high pressure or very, very high pressure, we will see, and blast and explosion effects attenuation for, for the automotive, for the trucks. 
clearly uh, one of the main applications for us for the automotive are the airbags. In fact, the gas generator for the airbags. It's a small tank made with a tube here and with a filter. And in the tube, you have the different components which explode in case of problem, accident, and our products here the special filter with a high density for sure. They are, uh, filter, they are here to filter the gas before uh, the cushion and to stop the potential particles, solid particles or fired uh, particles to be flow in the, in the cushion. So airbags generator. We are manufacturing also uh, different uh, pieces for the automotive. Here we have pieces for the exhaust pipes with different, different shape, different gaskets for different rings, different, one more time, different parts for the automotive. These pictures are interesting uh, today to show to you that we are able to, to design something with a different shape and different density and different functions, only with the same, core, with the same basic products, the mesh. So we talk about uh, EMC shielding also, but it's more for the electronic devices and the automotive mainly for us. We have this application, it's a fun application. I mean, uh, you could imagine we, f we fold the tank with a mesh, a special mesh, two applications for that, two, two reasons for that. The first one was uh, to avoid the movement of the gasoline in the tank for this kind of application for the motorcycle also. But the main application, the most important application today of this mesh, specific mesh for the tank is this kind of application. I mean, in this, case, this type of car, you don't want to hear, to listen the, the noise of the gasoline in the tank. So the tank is full with the mesh and it's an attenuator for the, for the noise. So we have also an, an assembling service in, in these uh, two cases, this one and this one. Uh, absolutely no pieces are made by Rodius. We are only in charge of the assembling of these components and these uh, sets for the automotive, here bicycle, here for the medical systems, and we are only do the, doing the assembling of that. We have also a department for the engineering, like I wrote from the design to the installation, in fact, from the design to the, to the engineering and to the industrialization for this kind of products, for example, or also for the uh, medical device here in China for us. So at a glance for the automotive, we are present in the exhaust pipe, in the electronics device, for the vibrations and also and mainly at the moment for the airbags. Our reference in the automotive sectors are the main uh, constructor, European constructor and also their, their subcontractor. So we talk about Toyota, Audi, of course, BMW, uh, Volkswagen and the other ones. So we are really strong in the automotive markets for this kind of parts. So the, the rest of our activities, I mean the industrial sectors, so different applications, different, really different sectors. The first one is uh, the anti-vibration sector. So I mean, uh, when you are a designer, if you have a problem with the vibration, 99% of the time you, you are designing something with an elastomeric couch, an elastomeric parts, it's okay. But in case of really high, really low temperature, in case of aggressive, corrosive environment, I mean seawater, acid, oil, the elastomeric does not work. So in this case, we are able to provide, to design and provide some pieces, really anti-vibration, resistant to this uh, corrosive and aggressive environment. So for the ships, for example, different uh, support for the engine, different support compensator for the exhaust pipe here. Here it's another application more or less uh, related to the vibration. In fact, here we are looking to stop the noise, so to stop the level of the vibration 
to avoid the, the noise, in fact, for this kind of flexible tube. For example, here it's a tube for Mercedes. In fact, on, on the pictures, interesting, we, 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 have, we have different laboratory and here we see the noise. We are working on the mesh and at the end with the same graph, the noise disappeared. This is our job, noise attenuator. Another sector completely different here. Uh, the, the principle is to avoid or to protect here the seats against the vandalism, anti-cut, anti-vandalism for the strain seats, for example. Now we are starting to talk about the main subject today, the filtration process and solution for the filtration and the separation. So at Rolius, when we talk about filtration, we mean a separation process. We are manufacturing based on mesh pads, different droplet separators. I mean demisters. Demisters, it's a liquid gas separator. Uh, we talk about coalition, it's a liquid liquid separator. And we talk also about agglomerator. The agglomerator, it's a, a mesh pad which is increasing the size of the droplet in a mist, for example, for different applications. So for sure, we have also some filtration, classical fil filtration solutions. I mean solid particles in a gas flow or solid particles in a liquid flow. And different other applications for catalysts, for mixers and different mesh pads for curious applications sometimes. So how main applications are located in the polymer and thin chemical, oil and gas, seawater, power generation, the various industry, green or clean technologies, food and beverage, paper, pulps. We have really, really a range of application really large. So first of all, generally I introduce Rodius firstly as a designer of Filter, filter or separator. What I mean is uh, we are able, we have a, a team, uh, an engineering team, engineering and processing team able to do some numeric simulation, test in-house with different uh, laser and different, uh, different test rig for that. And we are also able to do this kind of uh, measurement, different uh, laboratory service directly on site at place on the location of our customers. This picture pictures is really interesting because it's a reason about our knowledge. Here in this case, this particular case, we were on the top of this tower, 70 meter high, with a corrosive atmosphere, with an important flow rate, and our job was with these, these objectives. First of all, measurement number one, it's to evaluate the problem to say to the customers, yes, it's a smoke, but what about, what, what kind of smoke? So second, recommendations. We propose a solution to the customers. Three, we design and the construction for the solution. Four, installation with our own supervision. We are not in charge of the installation, but we are on the set to do the supervision, to be sure that all the elements, all the demisters, are installing in the right way to be efficient. Fourth, the measurement number two, it's the validation of the expected results. So here, in this case, we installed a uh, big demisters here, 70 square meter of demisters, and we received the validation about uh, the results. So here, the problem was solved. So as I said, from the beginning, the first measurement, to the solution, the supervision, and the final inspection to say, yeah, okay, the problem was solved. This is really the pictures about how knowledge. Of course, we are also able to manufacture, but this is one of how had value for, for the market and one of the how main argument on the market. So for, for the products, themselves. So the first are the liquid gas separator, I mean the droplet separator, the demisters, the neat, the agglomerator, the eliminators. There is lots of 
word for the same product. This one, it's a mesh pad, it's a liquid gas separator. Different shapes, different material. Here, it's a complete PVDF demisters for a, a chloride filtration. Here, it's a, a stainless with this kind of shape. Here, a stainless also with a, with a, a grid, a support frame, with different fastening systems, but it's used. Here we have something uh, original with a double layer. The first layer, it's a alloy 20, and the second one, it's a PTFA. It's for the sulfuric acid elimination. Stainless, polypropylene with a grid, also in polypropylene, different shape, different way to, to work on this kind of products. The second alternative for our products is the liquid-liquid separation. I made the coalition here made with a mesh pad. We have two solutions for the liquid-liquid separation. The first one here, we are using a mesh pad demisters. In fact, the, the goal is compared with the usual gravity separation here. We have these two pictures, they are really uh, clear because in fact with the gravity separation, you need some time to do the, the real separation. And if we used the mesh pads, the separation is sped up. So uh, shorter separation times, this is the goal, and the optimization about the results of the separation. Liquid-liquid separation, coalition made with the demister, the mesh pad. Here you, you have a, a mesh pad coalition, here made with a stainless and a polypropylene to be able to separate two different liquids. The second way to work for the liquid-liquid separation, the coalition, is to use this kind of products, the candles. So exactly the same pictures. With gravity, you need the time and you need a, a long time and a long way before the separation. With the candles, you speed up the separation and you will have at the end a better, uh, a nicer result. So, but the main issue is to reduce the time for the separation to increase the result also. Two types of candles here, there's a laboratory candles, small one. Here it's a full metal fibers candles. Here it's a PVDF candles with a stainless frame, but two candles for the liquid-liquid separation. We are also present in this kind of application, perhaps interesting in, the, in your area, uh, the seawater desalination. In fact, it's a, a quite a, a demister, or a, it's a mix between the demisters and the coalition, because in fact, we, we separate at the end the salt water to the classical or the usual water. So different, uh, different, application here it's for the sea uh, for, for the sea no sorry <laughs> for the air treatment here it's a air mist uh, separator made with this kind of cartridges here the cartridges so these products are made with stainless galvanized aluminium polymer and fibers or combination fibers and uh, and stainless for example for different application like a pre filtration or acid mist separation, oil mist, or also the filtration of the fat. But it's a classical cartridge, more or less like the same than we have in uh, our own kitchen, in the oven. So, different pictures about the cartridges, I think really original. We have also this kind of shape. It's still the same application to separate a liquid from uh, an air, a gas flow, or to separate a liquid in a liquid in another liquid flow, and here the shape is a candle. It's a tube, in fact, at the end. Different application, different uh, performance, and different uh, sectors for the activity. But it's exactly the same way for us, a demister or a coalition. Uh, to complete our basic offer, sometimes we are able or we propose to complete our offer with a mesh pad. For example, with this kind of application, the wave separator, 
generally uh, com in combination with a mesh pad to optimize or to, to, to increase the results at the end about for, for uh, separation efficiency. We have some uh, application also with this kind of ring, metal or plastic rings, included in the cartridges, in a frame, for different application and different other typical products, usual, but to complete our offer. In parallel of the products, we are also able to propose a service supervision for the assembly as I explained later, before. So in this case, sometimes uh, for specific or difficult uh, application with the original demister, something like that, we propose to the customers to do the, the supervision of the installation to be sure that the demister is installed in the right way to be efficient, like calculated or estimated at the beginning. And also to propose and to confirm to the customers a, a real guarantee about the result because we are present during the installation and we can sign at the end the document to say okay the demonstration is the right one the installation is correct so at the end we could we could guarantee the results of the filtration efficiency different projects for us only to be considered as a project uh, we are working on this kind of application so to do some catalyst uh, for us the catalyst it's at the end a mesh pad coated with something reactive with the flu or with uh, the fluids in fact we we can coat the mesh with a silver with a titanium oxide for example platinum to do a real catalyst so but it's not a, a classical product it's more a project and something uh, on we are working on it we are also working on this kind of project to say to the customers today we are able to design and to propose the, the simple the single candle but we would like to uh, to be able to design the complete vessel to say to the customers you need eight candles like this one and if you would like at the end to have a uh, right efficiency, you need to have this kind of vessel up to you to, design, to, to manufacture the, the vessel or to find a subcontractor. But we are also able to advise and to propose the design for the complete vessel related with how home products, the candles or the mesh pads. And the last project uh, for the future for us is to solve this bad subject so to study some uh, new scrubber filter for the exhaust for the exhaust on the ships like that so at a glance our main application and the with, the with our products the mesh pad demisters coalition agglomerator are in the petrochemical in the seawater desalination natural gas gas in general the acids, the chloride, the sulfur, the steam, the air treatment, smokes, hydrogen also. So here you have uh, as a, uh, a presentation, one of the biggest demisters we, we did uh, in the past, 12 meters diameters. And the pictures is interesting because we put a car, a golf, just to have a better understanding about the size of these demisters. It's for the Middle East. Different reference for us in this in these sectors, from Lanxess to Aldor Topso, from Hydrogenics to Sidem Veolia, uh, with of course Turn. And as explained at the beginning, our partner, uh, main partner Turn for Scandinavia and Baltics, with these nice people able to work with you. So, how argument, the knowledge, the product range, the global capabilities, the productivity, the pro proximity, the reactivity with our partner turn directly uh, located in, in your countries, and a few words like efficiency, reliability, quality, competitiveness. At a glance, the knitted wire mesh, simple, with many applications. Thanks 
for your attention. Mm-hmm.